I have a sleeping bag, I have a sleeping mat, I have walking sticks, I have quite a lot of camping things, so it's all natural that I get a travel pillow, either for travel or uh, for camping, anything like that. So in this uh, this one, it's not expensive, and apparently it's a push type pillow, meaning you don't have to blow any air into it. You just push and inflate. One thing I'm not 100% sure is how comfortable this is going to be right here. So let's inflate the pillow first and see how quickly it's going to inflate. I'm going to close this valve right here. Okay. And looking at my watch, let's see. Let's start. Okay, still going. If you put it on table and you press it, you don't want really because you won't get any air. But doing it like this. So keep pressing until you get the desired firmness. I'm gonna go all the way. As you can see, it's almost there. Keep pressing. This is a little bit more difficult as the pillow inflates. It's not that hard, really. And I would think that the pillow is now inflated. And that took me just about, oh, I think, a minute and a half to inflate the pillow. Close this valve up. And your pillow is ready. Feels soft to the touch. Feels good and firm. Now, I don't think I'm gonna sleep with it. Uh, as far as my uh, regular pillows go, I'm gonna still use mine. But what I'm gonna try to see, if uh, it holds air, and let me just pump a couple of times more in it, make it much firmer. Okay, and I'm still going to use it, but uh, I'm going to use it as uh, a support for my legs and all that, and my knees, because I have some back problems, and I'm going to see how this fares uh, over the next couple of days. But other than that, like I said, it feels nice and neat for a pillow. I'm basically going to deflate it now and see how small we can fit it into this uh, little bag right here that we came with it anyway. Open this up. And I'm gonna open this piece up as well. And the pillow's been deflated in just a few seconds. So I'm rolling it like this to get most of the air out of it, keeping that valve open. The only big thing about this is this push uh, press right here that uh, takes a little bit of space. Other than that, if you didn't have that, you can see how small you could have got this, you know. So roll it any way you want. It's gonna go nicely in my rucksack. Here you go. I made it as small as I could. But when you try to put it in the bag, obviously it's gonna get just a touch bigger. 
and tighten this up. This is it. The Lupo little inflatable pillow. Good little device for camping, traveling, and like I said, I'm gonna use it for my legs uh, in the next few days and see if it keeps inflated and how comfortable it's going to be.